I never felt tomorrow closing in this fast. Oh, I guess time's in a rush. Leaves are falling down, but at least they grow back. While I'm on a one-way track. Hey, friends! Welcome to Whiskey and Wit. I'm Whitney, and this is Finn. And today we are doing Finn's 10-month update. So stay tuned. If you are new to my channel, this is not typical content that I post here. This is a DIY home decor channel, but I did share my pregnancy in 2019 and 2020 with you guys, so I wanted to circle back and give you guys an update on Mr. Finn, who is officially 10 months old. Can you say hi? Can you wave? The last time we did one of these, Finn was six months old, and so it has been a little bit since we've given an update. As you can see, he has grown a ton, he is on the move, and he is teething as well. So we're going informal today. We are sitting on the floor in the living room. Sebastian is hanging out behind us, and we're just going to share some updates and some fun clips of Mr. Finn because so many of you have sent such sweet messages, wanted to know how his first Christmas went, and all that fun stuff. So I figured 10 months, it's been a little bit. Let's recap. <laughs> are you vocal now too? with somebody on the move right now, crawling everywhere, climbing up on things, playing with toys. It is a lot harder to sit and film one of these, so we will do the best we can. Finn now has eight teeth. He's got four on top and four on bottom with a lot more coming. And so these little pacifier teethers have been a godsend. So these are made for like frozen fruit or really anything, but I found these little Dollar Tree ice cube trays I've gotten from like summers past and they fit perfectly in there. We just freeze a bunch of ice cubes and he loves chewing on that and we call them popsicles and it has just been the best thing that we could give him. They're on Amazon and I'll link them below. So Finn has grown like crazy since his six month update. At his nine month appointment, the doctor measured him at 33 inches long, which is crazy. He is off the charts for everything and he is on the move. He's able to stretch for a lot of stuff. He's got long arms and legs and you are on the move, aren't you, sir? Oh yeah, are you about to steal the show? <laughs> yeah, we are standing up. We are standing up and then letting go because we are a daredevil baby. So we are just having super fun, aren't we? We're having so much fun. We're at that phase where there's usually always drool and stuff stuck on his face. He's usually got dog hair everywhere and you know what it's just it is what it is he is on the move we've also because he's on the move moved our main little coffee table out of the living room and so now we've got a big open space with some little mats from amazon which has been super helpful because he's moving all over the place our other new skill is crawling over to the step in our sunken living room and crawling up and trying to stick his hand in sebastian's water bowl so we've had to move that a few times Finn's first Christmas was so nice. Even though it was not a traditional Christmas, it was so great to kind of see it through his eyes. So here are some clips from his first Christmas. Good morning. It's Christmas. Did something come to our house last night? Oh, look at that. Oh, buddy. It says my auntie loves me. You are going to be styling. <laughs> Should we get him out so you can play with him? <laughs> There's a smile. Couple other updates. I have stopped nursing Finn. I have continued pumping, but once he got the teeth that he got, it was just 
like that was not gonna happen um, but I do have a goal of pumping until he is one so he can continue to get those nutrients I will say it again I've said it before but a fed baby is best I just am really proud of myself that I was able to do this I know some people just can't do it and so this was something that I was glad worked out for us another thing I mentioned last time was that I was struggling with postpartum depression and anxiety and I am still on that road and the reason that I share this is if you are at a point where you feel like this pandemic is just hitting you a little harder than it should you aren't feeling yourself and you really need to talk to someone I would highly advocate for it I would highly recommend it and I just started my process online looking for kind of what that looked like looking for some people near me and it was one of the best things that I did and also I can't thank you enough for your sweet comments on that last video because it was a lot to open up i just appreciate the support because i want to be transparent with you guys and it's not always easy being vulnerable but you guys made it worth it another thing that he loves are his love every boxes and i've mentioned these in updates before but we started with the three to four month box and worked our way all the way up now he's in the nine to ten month box and what love every boxes provide are some really fun really nice like wood toys and some other soft toys that work really well for each of those age ranges so we started with a three to four month that gave us a lot of teething things and a lot of other toys they were nice enough to send us the nine and ten month box for him to start playing with a couple weeks ago and so he has been loving playing with all the different toys what i love about these subscription boxes is they come in two month chunks and you get all the toys that are really good for developmental things throughout that portion uh, as well as a little guide booklet so if he's sitting and playing with a specific toy i can then go to the book open it up figure out what that skill is that he's supposed to learn from that and kind of how to set up that play so it is educational for him what i also love at this stage in life for him is that everything is teething friendly it is all organic and so when he grabs all the toys and shoves them in his mouth then they are nice and safe and we don't have to worry about it I will link more information down in the description below about Love Every so you can check it out as well as a link to purchase. We absolutely love the boxes and we are going to actually purchase one for a friend that recently had a baby. So we are excited to also gift Love Every boxes as well as enjoy them at our house. Thank you so much for watching. Also, thank you for all of your kind comments and words of support for our family. It is so crazy that Finn is going to be one year old in just two months that is just so crazy i feel like i was just telling you guys i was pregnant but you know this year as crazy as it's been it has flown so again thank you for your support of our family for always asking about finn also if this is your first time stopping by my channel be sure to hit subscribe so you don't miss any future finn videos or diy content and we will catch you guys in the next one ready bye you say bye